Senegalese. My name is Rick Decker. And welcome to our Cyclone Adventures! And did you know that the eye is in the centre of a cyclone and can vary in size from 10 to 100 kilometres, depending on the severity of the storm? Hey, don't forget the rest. After that eye passes, the wind blows with equal strength but in the opposite direction. A cyclone is an area of low pressure with blowing centre-clockwise <coughs> and anticlockwise around it in the southern hemisphere. A tropical cyclone is a cyclone that forms with tropics. Imagine that. Tropical, um, tropical cyclones are given different names to show how the winds are. Here's a list of different names. Sally Carl, Vicky and Wilfred, there for 2014. Marshall Lee and Pam Kate, there for 2015. Danielle, Richard, Walter and Bonnie, there for 2016. Emily, Dan, Nate and Greta for 2017. William, Tony, Kate, Chris and Florence there for 2018. Andrew, Melissa, Chantel and Wendy are for 2019. That's like ages. These are just the, some of the names if you want, if you just want to know more to go names of cyclones, Google. Tropical cyclones from the southern hemisphere spin in clockwise direction, while on the other hand, hurricanes and typhoons in the northern hemisphere spin in anti-clockwise directions. Cyclone Tracy struck down on Christmas Eve, 1974, which I may add is a year before my mum was born. Cyclone Tracy was Australia's most destructive cyclone. It has a tech, um, scientifically, it. It scientifically been proved how many people were killed, but we know hundreds were injured during cyclone chasing. There were wind gusts up to 290 kilometers per hour. Annabelle, why don't we tell them the difference between a cyclone, hurricane, typhoon and tornadoes? Well, technically a cyclone is any kind of circular windstorm. <coughs> but it's the only used to describe a strong tropical storm third off the coast of India. Hurricanes and typhoons are the same thing but in different places. Basically, in the Philippines it is called typhoon. Hurricanes occur in the Atlantic and typhoons in the Pacific. Pacific Ocean. And Bell, let's talk about alerts. Great idea, because this keeps safe, you need to follow the alerts. <laughs> Blue event means prepare for dangerous weather. Yellow yeah, means take action, get ready to go to shelter. <laughs> Red alert means go to shelter immediately. All clear means that wind and storm <laughs> surge dangers have passed. But. You need to take care to avoid the dangers caused by damage. The low pressure centre of a cyclone is known as the eye of the storm. Did you know? Did you know the average life of a cyclone is one week? Mm, I don't think you guys did it all. Let's start with something else. Categories! <laughs> Cyclones are put into categories depending on the wind strength. 
Category one, Gales. Uh -huh. Okay. 90 to 105, 125 kilometers per hour. Category two, destructive. 125 to 164 kilometers per hour. Category three, very destructive. 165 to 240 kilometers per hour. Category four, very destructive. 240 to 279 kilometers per hour. Category 5, very destructive. More than 290 kilometers per hour. Basically, hurricanes and typhoons form over water and are huge, while tornadoes form over land and are much smaller. A plus a tropical cyclone is an intense low pressure system that occurs on the summer months near northern Australia. Once again, my name is Annabelle Wilson. And once again, my name is Meg Rudman. And thank, thanks for watching. See ya. See ya.